The Pit. Holy shit, this movie is fucking awesome. Um, this movie's about this little boy who has some form of, like, autism or something. I don't know. He's just really weird. And he doesn't have any friends. His best friend is this teddy bear who is, uh, it's implied that this teddy bear may be possessed by Satan. There's a lot of really hilarious scenes where he's talking to his teddy bear and, um, the boy's family doesn't even know how to deal with him. So they have, like, these, uh, young girls come and, um, Basically, they're, they're psychology majors, and they're trying to see if they can connect with their son. And he is go, starting to go through puberty, so he's starting to get, like, these sick fascinations with... Uh, I wouldn't call it sick. I would call it perfectly healthy. Uh, and especially because um, this new student, Nanny, whatever you want to call her, is she's pretty good looking. And he has an obsession with his school teacher too, and he does all this funny shit. Like uh, he's he starts getting he starts becoming a little manipulative when uh, things aren't really going his way, and things really don't ever go his way. Um, like he calls his teacher, and he like makes a recording of his voice, calls his teacher, and then goes outside of her window window and tells her that if she doesn't strip nude, that he's going to kill her niece. And then he takes pictures of her. <laughs> There's like this hilarious scene where he's looking at the pictures and like Teddy's talking to him. And Teddy's like, you're going to look at these a lot. <laughs> um, uh, and Teddy's voice is obviously his voice. And just, uh, I, I don't know. But the kid who, uh, the, the main kid in this, his performance is pretty amazing in this movie. And the coolest thing about this movie is... Um, out in the middle of nowhere, out in these little like wooded area, there's this pit in the ground, and there's these like prehistoric um, hog type people creatures that live down there, and he calls them tralalas, and uh, they need meat to survive, so he tries feeding them, but then he realizes, you know, that he needs to start feeding them people. So um, all these people that pick on him one by one, he just <laughs> it's it's a really hilarious montage of <laughs> him just tricking all these people that have treated him like shit and just pushing them down there into the pit to get eaten by these tralalas. Um, anyways, I'm not going to talk about what happens at the end or not. If you haven't seen this movie, you should definitely check it out. It's a classic.